TikTok goes. Dude, this is a medium shirt, and this shirt is oversized. Like, this, like I'm not even filling the shirt out, really. Like, it's really an oversized fit. It's a medical issue. Yeah, I mean, dude, TikTok, it's such a toxic app, dude. Like, I don't know. I TikTok helped me grow so much. But it does have a lot of downsides to it. Jules, people, people like you are why I hate TikTok. Hmm. So... I don't know. They have to what? Try not to sell TikTok? Are they gonna do it? God, I don't know. You know? As a content creator, all I can do is just post on whatever platform is available and not worry about things that I can't control. The same height when he sits down. Short, bro, I'm only 5'2". It's tough out here for us short kings. They're going on vacation. Who, China is? TikTok is? Wait, so who? Your testosterone video today was helpful. Thanks, bro. I'm glad. So. Wait. What was I saying? You miss me? Aw. What was I saying, bro? Oh wait, no, no. So when TikTok, when TikTok bought the app, who who had Musically? Who owned Musically before TikTok was was bought? You didn't. <laughs> Yeah, I like my cute cup, bro. Yeah, rocking with it. What? It's funny, like, genuinely, when you're trying to lose fat, bro. Dude, when you're trying to lose fat, most of the time when your body thinks that you're hungry, your, your brain thinks that you're hungry, you're either thirsty or you're bored. By, oh, by Ted, I don't even, I, dude, I don't know who that is. I used to think, I used to think musically, I was like, bro, musically is so cringy. I hate musically, but look at me now. I'm a, I'm a TikToker now, bro. Until, until it's gone, I've been a TikToker for like almost two years. And it's like, I don't know. You're 98 pounds, that's because you don't eat enough. If you were in a calorie surplus, then you would be gaining weight. It's going house voted today. Yeah, but if China sells it, TikTok's still gonna be an app. If they don't sell it, which is actually funny because like, I don't, what, what, what are they saying? Are they, do they not want China taking our information? Why do they think TikTok's gonna take our information but the other platforms don't? Hey, 
And then if you're talking about social media in general, every single social media platform is draining us anyways. It's not just TikTok. And I'm not even acting like I like TikTok that much. Like TikTok wasn't even my favorite platform. Instagram was and still is. And at least YouTube, I don't even have to like look at the comments when I like watch a video. Well, I really don't on any platform. The war, China said that they won't physically attack. Well, that's exactly what they've been doing. That's exactly what China's been doing. And then they feed us this trash content. They promote the most stupid videos. You don't know, let me take that back. I'm sorry, I didn't mean that. I didn't mean that. They don't promote informational videos. Let's just say that. It's videos that don't have value that blow up. I know it myself because I used to post the six second me flexing at school videos. Those videos would blow up. Me posting anything informative does not blow up at all. Luca, what up? Yeah. That's exactly what's going on. I think most, most people are aware of it. Actually, most people probably aren't aware of it. That's actually what's wrong. Most people just have short attention spans and their brain is fried from scrolling all day. And they think that just scrolling will fix their, the cure, will be the cure to why their brain's fried, but it just keeps digging them into this hole. So, am I an atheist? Oh, where's my chain? I'm not. I, I'm a man of God, bro. I actually don't know where I put my chain. But. Nah, bro. Yo, I've been going to church too. Even if I if I'm on vacation, my, I can watch church from like YouTube. I'll watch it virtually, bro. I've been a good Christian boy, man. You know. Vacation, vacation, vacation. Dude, I need to like just chug this. Cap. For a good Christian boy, that's what I am. Dude, this is gonna be so mad. <sighs> Why buy TikTok? Because TikTok is not <laughs> gonna be on the, on our app stores for long, bro. What's so bro, like what's gonna happen? Is TikTok just gonna like not be on our, our phone? Are they just gonna like automatically delete it? I subscribe to YouTube. Thanks, bro. I would say, follow, yo, follow my Instagram, y'all. If TikTok goes, follow the Instagram. Instagram is our main platform. It's the same username as my TikTok. Damn. So Vine, I don't, dude, I wasn't even on Vine at all. Did Vine just like get deleted? And it was there the next day, it just wasn't on your, on your phone? How was my day? My day was great, bro. Other than the fact that I, I posted a, I posted something on Instagram, but I messed up the audio, bro. So I deleted the video. But yeah, I mean, 
I feel like we all knew, like, it TikTok blew up so fast. Like, I don't know. I feel like we all knew TikTok wasn't going to be around forever. Or we all thought it. And the chances are... I mean... The U.S. doesn't want TikTok on our phones anymore. Cash out your gift money? Dude, it, it already goes, like... They sent it to my PayPal... Like, weekly. It's not, like... Like, it doesn't all, like, just store up anymore. Like, it automatically cashes out, if that makes sense. I think every Wednesday. So, maybe today? Taking them what? I actually don't know. Pills? I mean, yeah, I mean, Legion has them. Like, I'm with Legion. I actually used to take these fat burners, but I genuinely did not see any difference. Wait a minute. I feel like... When did I start taking these? I know I used to take fat burners. Hmm. How do you move your pecs? It's a... Uh, it's a very simple thing to do. Squeeze, exactly. But do I suggest taking them? Really, like, fat burners only work if you're already... On a cut, you're already in a calorie deficit and you're just trying to shred, shred, like shred off a little bit more body fat. But, bro, like, there's such a minimal, minimal effect that I don't know. Like, is it, is it worth $50 for a 1% increase or decrease in body fat percentage? Like, is it worth it? I don't know. Even like, I'm with Legion. I would say if you're gonna if you're gonna get supplements, get creatine, get pre workout, get protein powder. Fat burners, they're not like an essential supplement. So if you're gonna get something, get something that's gonna directly. Well, this is supposed to directly whatever impact, but get something that's a lot more cost effective. You inspire my chest pump. Let's get it. Quad God. An example. What do you mean? Pre-workout, protein powder, and creatine are the three main supplements. Even multivitamins, I would, I would recommend over fat burners. Like, fat burners are like... They're like six... They're like seventh on my list of supplements, of like supplements that I would advise you to get. They're not even in my top five. Example, you just move it, bro. When you practice enough chest exercises, you know how to how to move your muscles, bro. I'm 5'10". Creatine made me feel so bloated and made my stomach feel sick. I don't think that's the creatine. I'm gonna be honest, bro. You can't do it. I, what? Yeah, creatine, I, I don't think that's the creatine, bro. You look taller in videos. What do your comments mean? Do you speak English, bro? <laughs> Alright, we're almost done with this water
Obviously, I feel I want to take the creatine. Yeah, I don't know what. Maybe the creatine was expired, bro. I don't know. The creatine that I take, I. T- the creatine that I take, I don't have any bad side effects from. And I take my, my Legion creatine. I take Legion creatine, blue raspberry is my favorite flavor. Coach Sauce will save you 20% off. Get you some Legion, bro. Blue raspberry. And it tastes good, too. It has a flavor. Yeah, I, dude, I don't really... I don't say I don't care about politics, but I don't spend my time and energy into politics. Because at the end of the day, we can't control politics. And at the end of the day, the president, there's people above the president. So why would you spend your precious time and energy into voting for someone when the president isn't even the one making all the decisions? There's people above. Do you really think that the president, like there's not people above him telling him what to do right now? Oh my gosh. So I just don't, I don't waste my, my energy into it. Like I like to control, like put my energy into things that I can't control. You can't, con- yeah, you have one vote, right? Yeah. You cannot control that much, bro. Let's be honest. I'm not leaving TikTok, bro. TikTok's leaving us. TikTok is leaving us. I'm not leaving TikTok, bro. TikTok is forced to... If China doesn't sell TikTok, they're removing it from the App Store. But it's like, when when we talk about politics, no president is perfect. No politician is perfect. So as an influencer, if I... Like, I, I don't even, like put too much time into into like what what their actual like political views are maybe like they're like like what they think about like i don't know like self improvement or like like social issues but like i don't know like political views like wars in other country like i don't spend time into that so i don't know exactly what every single politician says so if i were to say i support this person yeah i like this person i would just get so much backlash for saying, yeah, this person's a solid dude. Yeah, this person, like, I don't know. Like, I, I like. I like some people for, for some things that they say. But that doesn't mean that I even know or support every single thing that they say. So it's so difficult as someone who's like. Like, I don't know. I don't really put that much energy into, like, other people that I know every every single thing that they've said. That's not true. If I were to say, if I had, if I had strong beliefs about who I want who I want to win and why, and just beliefs about the world, TikTok (laughs) would say it's hate speech. Like if I had strong beliefs. People say freedom of speech, but the second that someone actually gives their freedom of speech and says what they really feel, they say that it's hate speech. Did I vote? No, I was like 15. You would say Trump, just yes or no. Trump or Biden, Trump. (laughs) Cancel me. (laughs) But yeah, no, that's so funny. Cancel me. (laughs) Your life was suspended, no. But yeah, no, it's like, and then it's like, bro, I'm finna get canceled. 
But like me saying that, like there's probably so many things that he said that if I really looked into politics that I wouldn't agree with. But that doesn't mean that like, I don't know. Just like if, if you talk about like an influencer. Um, <laughs> like if you talk about like an influencer that, that goes on a bunch of podcasts that I'm not even gonna like say a particular name. But if you talk about, yeah, like this person, like I might not agree with everything that he says, but he stands up for himself and he has strong beliefs and he he says what he means and he means what he says. And it's like, I don't know, people expect you to either be perfect or just be scared of even saying your beliefs. TikTok and coaching right again. Make America healthy again, bro. But yeah, like I don't, dude, I don't know that much about politics. Like I'm a fitness coach, fitness, fitness content creator. Like politics is not my niche, bro. Like, it's just not. Yeah, but. <laughs> but it's like, I don't know, at the end of the day, Whatever you say, or whatever I say, if I wanted everybody to agree with me, if I wanted everybody to like me, then that would drive me insane trying to please everybody. So it's like, And especially in 2024. Anything you say is going to piss someone off. You know? More water? Dude, I'm done with my water, bro. Damn. I'm getting canceled today, y'all. This is getting uh, on YouTube and uh, getting this whole live stream screen recorded. I'm not ready for it, bro. I'm not ready for it. They're going to say, oh, Sosta lives far right wing extremist. <laughs> God, I it. so funny. But. You gonna, <laughs> now, like, I saw a video or like tweets of. No, I'm I'm just joking, but I saw I saw like tweets of people like bro working out is right wing. Be trying to to be in shape is just so far right wing. I'm like, bro. So <laughs> I'm like, bro, what are you talking about? Like if you're trying to lift weights to look better, you are F-A-T, phobic. No one in real life. That's what I think. Until I see, like, these interviews. I, like, I'll see, like, people interviewing people, especially people at universities, bro. People at universities be so scared to get, if they're on the internet, talking talking crazy, saying something that's normal, <laughs> their, their degree is going to get snatched, bro. It's always the university people, like, they'll, they'll be at a college, they'll, they'll ask, like, a normal question, and then I'll be like, bro, what? I'm neither left or right, I'm up. Yeah, no, I don't, like, I'm not, I'm not voting this year. Like, I don't want to put, like, put my energy, oh, I get a sticker, oh, I vote. I just, I don't want, I, like, I, I don't want to put my energy into that, bro. Put out at the gym. Was it at the gym? January 6th? I don't know. 
Like even gen like I genuinely don't really know that much that happened. Like Like I don't like you can call me uh ignorant, but I don't know. I I feel like something that I have no control over, like trying to put my energy into that that's just going to put me in a negative mood. Like I feel like it's just not going to benefit my life. Dude, why is my computer Oh. Someone sent me a <laughs> But it's like, it's, it's funny though. Like, it's like, if I, if I genuinely like cared and put my energy into it, like it would just make 50% of, of people watching me have a hatred towards me be, because I'm, I'm this and I voted for this person. Like, I don't know. Even if I did vote, I wouldn't like. I wouldn't like just talk about it all the time, but like, I don't want to vote. I don't, I don't know. I just, I vote to make leg day mandatory. Like, all right, let's, let's talk about Vivek, like Vivek. Vivek, you see him on TikTok. He's a great speaker. A lot of social issues, a lot of like self-improvement stuff. I'm like, bro, that was well-spoken. That was like, bro, he's in very intelligent. But I don't know every single like thing about Paul, like every single political thing he said and that I agree. Like most of the stuff just goes over my head. I don't know every single thing or even, I don't know if I would agree with because a lot of the stuff I just don't understand what's going on in other countries and stuff. But like him himself, dude, I like him. Like, he's a great speaker. He looks extremely intelligent. Like, I don't know, bro. But that doesn't mean I agree with every single thing that he says. You feel me? But, I don't know. Don't be swayed. Um, if I like someone, I like someone. I'm not. I'm not gonna feel bad for liking someone. You are humble enough to admit. I mean, it's just true. The cup. Y'all think this is a joke, bro? I think something's funny. I think some funny, bro. It's normal if you're right, he's extremist. It's... I mean, y'all with the people, y'all with the people talk, talking about me, or y'all ask me about politics. Yeah, no, it's funny. Like, most people that vote, they genuinely, like, don't look into what's actually happening. I'm not voting, and I don't really know most of the stuff that's happening that they're actually, like, doing in the world. Like, if most people that voted, like, had to pass, like, a, a civics test, they would all fail, bro. <laughs> but it's like, I'm from Florida, so we're, we're red. Pretty red. At least, yeah. What was I saying, though? Oh, but yeah. Like, I think Vivek said that. He said, like, a lot of people that vote, like, really don't know what's going on. And that's that's mostly, like, the issue. Arizona, yeah, I don't know. UK, what does UK have? Does, does UK have, like, a... Do I, I, do, am, do I sound, like, stupid? I don't know. You aren't registered if you aren't. You don't have to go in the draft. What do you mean? Are you on the Trump train? <laughs> Don't say yeah he is. I'm not voting, bro. But if you say Trump or Biden, come on. 
UK is Congress and uh, okay. yeah. What does UK have? I've never like heard someone say like, oh, the UK president, this, this, the UK, whatever. Like I, well, I could probably look it up. I gotta go pee though. You're a person that's logical. Like to hear that. Hey, nah. UK has UK government. Thanks for the rose. Par. I don't even know how to say this. <laughs> but yeah, there's some um, prime minister. Well, I know who she was. Like, she passed away recently, but. President, we have a monarchy. Oh, you have a king. Love the dough? The do? The hair do? Who Taylor Swift is dating now? Please inform me. <laughs> <laughs> Gosh, no, please inform me. The hairdo, thanks, bro. How tall are you? 5'10. I'm not a Swift, you know. How am I so uninformed? Travis, who's Travis? I can answer any scientific or political question you might have. Well, all right, let me ask the audience a political question. Let, let me get informed today by my TikTok audience. Oh God, this is gonna be fun. Oh my God, freaking pee, bro. Can I mute this thing? I don't think I can. With a positive thank you. Ugh. He has to actually look up a question. Question. Let me think. Let me chat GBT. 10 questions to ask before you vote. 10 questions you should be well informed of. Um, it's a question I could ask. Oof. Oh no, I was gonna ask. <laughs> I was gonna ask about last election, but let me not. Can you do a mini poll for Trump or the now president? Let's not. Nah. So, uh, I'm not trying to get too political here. <laughs> we already got hella political, bro. This is a whole politics live stream. They, they're gonna ban me for like misinformation, even though I already said I don't know much about politics. Pro like, dude, Israel, I don't put my time and energy into that. I don't know what's going on. I am pro-peace. I don't believe anybody should be getting killed for unnecessary reasons. What am I gonna do? Dude, my main platform is Instagram. So I, just like politics, if I can't control it, I'm not gonna worry about it. That's how, that's how you should all, um, that's how I live my life and I enjoy my life. I'm not gonna tell you how to live your life, but say something like TikTok. If TikTok gets banned, I'm not gonna cry about it. I'm gonna, Put my energy into my Instagram, which is, oh my gosh, that could be bad, you know? Do you watch UFC? I don't. I have a UFC hoodie though. I low key am like starting to enjoy fights more though. We all have your videos backed up. <laughs> nah, I do get a lot of saves on all my videos, bro. I probably have a lot of videos just in random people's cam rolls. Just, just sitting there. 
But what was I saying? I don't know. No, I actually, I I've been like enjoying. Like if I see like a fight on or someone like boxing on, I low key am like more invested in it now. Your speech is in my oh for real? yo yo. I posted that on YouTube, bro. Supported for lost TikTok money. I mean, dude, TikTok TikTok has done me pretty well, bro. It's like, I can't lie. I, I mean, I've made a good amount of money on TikTok and TikTok has helped me grow my other platforms, my Instagram, my TikTok has grown a lot. I mean, like TikTok has done a lot of good for me. It, it's very negative, but it's helped my, it's helped my business grow. How much money overall? I don't know, a good amount. Austin deep fakes, bro. I'm gonna get cloned. Yo, I am on Instagram. Follow my Instagram. I post every day on my Instagram. I have a main Instagram, same username as my TikTok. I have a back backup account on my Instagram. Have a good night, Drew. You, fo you already found me? Let's get it. So it's like, dude, I'm not going anywhere, bro. Instagram is has always been my main platform. It's always been, dude, I have to go. Right now. You know, so don't worry, guys. Behave Dude, someone commented, I think it would help if you took behavioral psychology courses in college. What the heck is that? What the heck is that? So no, I was reading my comments on the, on my recent post. Someone's, John Smith, I think it would help, I think, yeah, I think it would help if you took behavioral psychology um, courses in college, psychology. What exactly is that? Behavioral, does my college even have this? Psychology. That would be hella creepy though. I would just be like looking at people like, why are you acting like that in college? Behavioral call it behavioral psychology. Please. Uh... All right, y'all. So should I should I end the live stream? Is it is it time to get off? Is it time? Do you have a an X? I I have an X, but I don't use it because X is hella weird. Um, let's not say weird. Let's say extremely disturbing. That's why I don't use it. Now that's not hate speech. That's genuinely a true statement. No, but sure. Is it really time? I don't know. If y'all talk, if y'all interacting, I could be on here for a good amount. Favorite drink, my favorite drink. Protein shake, a cookies and cream protein shake from Legion. Probably with fat-free milk, zero grams of sugar, 25 grams of protein. Favorite drink. Depends on what they say. Dude, I turn my comments off on my Twitter when it was still Twitter. I turned my comments off and I had random accounts reposting me. People reposting me talking about some weird stuff. I'm like, bro. I was like, yeah, no, this is bringing in the wrong audience. I want real people that have real accounts and follow me for my passion of fitness or because I can help them achieve their fitness goals. I mean, I'm, I'm know that a lot of people follow me because I look good because they think that I look good. 
but I don't, I don't want, how do I say this? I don't know. Like, y'all understand, bro. It was bringing in the wrong audience. The, the, I'm talking about to say it. It was bringing in, no, no, it wasn't even bots. No, 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 no. It was not bots. These bots were saying some disturbing stuff. And real, dude, I turned my comments off too. My comments were off and they were still reposting. Oh my gosh, yes. The wrong audience. No, I was posting fitness content. Like I'm over here posting. Oh, this is this is how I blah 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 in the gym. Oh my gosh. I don't, I don't know. If you look up Twitter, or if you look at my Twitter, oh, I just looked up sustenless, sustenless. I'm not even gonna look at my Twitter. This is just weird stuff. It's like they try to turn, they try to turn anybody that's in shape into an OnlyFans model that just sells their soul for money. That's what people on X do. That's what I typed in, bro. I'm so mad at myself, right? But sauced in meat. So that's why I don't use Twitter because it's extremely disturbing. And it like it genuinely like it's sad how godless like people on the app are because like you like you go on Twitter and it's either like a like a like a corn site or it's if if it's not that it's just straight arguing about like the most random stuff in the world people are just going on for days just arguing about I'm a Christian yeah Christian I I go to a non-denominational church Sauce and secret sauce. Yeah. So I was like, yeah, I don't, I don't mess with that stuff. See, TikTok, at least like, if the comment is that, uh, unmoral, they'll just say, filter the comments, whatever. I'm not, I am not leaving TikTok chat. TikTok is leaving me, potentially. So if you want to still follow me and not forget that I ever existed, check out the Instagram. Instagram is the same username as my TikTok because TikTok might be leaving us. Unless China doesn't sell, TikTok is going away, bye-bye. And that's not in my control. If it wasn't my control, maybe I would take TikTok down actually. But TikTok has helped me out a lot. Why is it why exactly? I'm not sure the exact reason. I think it's because they say that they're they're like hacking on information or they're take up or I don't even know. If that's what they do, yeah. I don't use it. Cause it's not the best app in the world to use. Oh my god, I have to go be. TikTok is well they have to sell. So that's what's gonna happen. And yeah, Twitter has no restrictions at all. <laughs> like no restrictions. They ticked. Well you could definitely make an argument for the algorithm. But then again, like my algorithm is just self-improvement stuff most of the time. And if it's not, if it's like stuff that I don't want to see, I'll just click. I don't want to see this. Like, don't recommend me this or I block the people. I don't get why people will see. Like people will see like my page. They'll leave a hate comment. I'm like, yeah, like Insta real comments are insane. So, dude, they, some of them are just so funny. I'm not going to lie. Just extremely hilarious, but it's like gen genuinely if it's like if it's like a genuine hate comment like the person made you mad and it's not like something that's actually like funny. If if like you're if it's not funny and you're just trying to make the person's day worse, dude, just block the person. Just block the person. It'll save y'all both 
Actually, well, like when you leave a comment, it, it helps the person's page, but whatever. <sighs> yeah, comments are filtered, yeah. You have nothing better to do than leave a negative hate comments. I mean, yeah. I don't like I I don't know. I, I see I I saw a stat that's like people I don't know the exact number, but people are way more likely to share a post that's negative to their friends than share a post that's positive or like, you know. I went to Fort Lauderdale. I went to well like Miami ish. I went to Miami like a month ago maybe. I'm not doing that much for spring break. Tomorrow I'm getting my legs waxed, but I want to do something this weekend. I try getting what? Yeah, tomorrow's my rest day, getting my legs waxed. I want to do something this weekend for content. I don't know what though. You've changed on. Oh, sorry. Not sorry. People share negative stuff because it makes them f themselves feel better. Legs waxed. This is going to be fun. Pool bars. Not that I know of. No. It's a time. 6.39. Yeah, no, it's it's like a good pain, though. It's like, I don't know. I, I like, like it, though. Because when you, bro, when you shave your legs, it grows back thicker. And when it grows back, it grows back in a day. If like when I wax my legs, it grows back in like a month and a half. T like I got my legs waxed, I think like January, like 25 the last time. So like a month and a half to two months. I do it so that I can see my muscles. And because I don't like the look of like hairy legs, I just, I don't like how that like it looks on my legs. I like like. The smooth look. You got your eyebrows waxed? What? Advice I would give to myself. Sus. I don't think getting a legs wax is sus. I think something like having G-A-Y space S-E-X with a man would be sus. I don't think getting my... I don't think getting my legs waxed is sus. I think there's many things more sus than that. All right, advice I would give to myself when I started my fitness journey. Ooh. I'm actually, ooh. Ooh. Dude, I can't think straight right now. Definitely stop. <laughs> Yo, y'all finna get me canceled. But... All right, all right. All right, advice I would give to myself. I would give to myself, I mean, don't stress over eating the perfect foods. Food cup. <laughs> don't stress over eating the perfect foods. I would say don't overtrain. What, what do y'all mean get my eyebrows waxed? Like, when, I, when you think wax, you think just, just tear it all off. Yeah. Let me wax my legs in peace. What the heck? Like, come on, bro. I don't have any tats. I don't want any. But... What, what does it mean? Cheerio? What are you, a cereal? Cheerio. I don't know, like my barber like trims them. I don't, I don't want tats because they're too permanent and I don't like the look. Cheerio. <laughs> Your name, your name is Cheryl. Why are you trying to come at me, Cheryl? Cheryl. Hey, th those are not my pronouns. Do not mess up my pronouns. I am very serious about those. Cheryl. <laughs> oh God, dude, I have to go pee so bad. Dude, I got canceled at least twenty times on this live stream. Thankfully, I'm not a. Uh, 
mainstream. Cherry oil. I'm sorry. I think it's because I have to go pee. That's why. It's like it's like bringing out the like aggression in me. Cherry oil. It, I said it's got to be some type of cereal. I said like your name is like it's got to be like a cereal or something. Cherry oil. No, I don't like the share L. No. Uh oh my god, you're so slow. I hate how girls text, bro. That's why I don't text woman. Woman, T emoji. Don't worry, I'm screen recording. <laughs> oh, no! Please don't, please don't. No. Instagram. Hey, this, this is the perfect time to follow my Instagram. If there's any time that you're gonna follow my Instagram, it's now. So you like texting guys? Yeah, I do. Not for reasons that you would think of, but for business reasons. Life stream, let's not. Oof. But nah, it's just like, I don't know. It's like texting woman is like, I'd rather just, thank you for the confetti. I'd rather just be in my bed, just like staring at the wall than like, cause like you have to like think of something that's like, like generally like okay to say to her, like, but I can give you a massage. Cherry oil. I don't think I want to do that. I actually uh, don't like massages because they don't feel good. <sighs> I have no riz. That might be true. Hey, they say practice makes progress and I don't practice. So maybe that's where I'm going wrong. I don't think I talk to women enough. The fist bump trick, I don't. Is it like a way to get a happy ending or something? Is that the secret to getting a happy ending during a massage? I don't know, I don't wanna. <sighs> Shrimp, right? You raise in the muscles, it's inside of them. Do you have a clapper? Mom is a what? A baker? My mom can cook, yeah. My mom can cook some good food. So you have children? Um, adopted children? Just spat, just spat your drink, okay. That's okay, you got some cleaning up to do. Wait, what? That's Riz? That's a Riz? What's up, Matt? Matt Loki Alex, what's up, my homie? Thank you, Christian, for the follow. What am I gonna do? Probably live the same exact life, but just not post on TikTok and not go on TikTok lives. Yo, my Instagram is on main platform. Like, I'm not stressing over a TikTok ban because my, with my TikTok, I really just posted everything that I posted on my Instagram anyways. So my life is not going to change that much. Yeah, I post more on Instagram. I post stories on Instagram. I interact with my Instagram more anyways. So, and I have a backup account on Instagram. No, it's funny though, like TikTok, TikTok has like anything political that happens, it's on TikTok 
in a heartbeat. Like they spread like wildfire. Toxic. <laughs> yeah, I, I I feel like it's not like even if it get ban- if like if it gets banned, there's gonna be another app that just recreates TikTok. Like there's no way if TikTok if TikTok gets banned. There's not going to be another app that just completely copies what TikTok does. Like, I feel like every other social media platforms are just all talking to each other right now and coming up with like a grand plan. Like, a, like I don't know. If t- like if TikTok gets banned, something's going to happen. And whether it's a new app or other apps just get more like TikTok... Like, something's going to happen. Like, even Instagram is already like TikTok. There's YouTube Shorts or Snapchat, whatever they're called. I don't know. Yeah, no, though. I, like, I remember a few months ago when, like, the TikTok CEO or someone was talking to, like, I don't know, Congress or something. It didn't look good for the U.S., but that was months ago. Your snaps, Cheryl. I thought you said that I I didn't like women. Cheryl, am I attractive to you? Like, are you attracted to like? Thank you for the for the heart. Do you have like a fetish or something? Nice to see you back. Thanks, bro. I am glad to be back until TikTok kicks me off. I like, I, she has a type, right? Slow guys. Unfortunately, I'm not your type because I'm not slow. I take pride in how fast of a human being I am. So, I, I guess I'm just not your type then. There should be age limits for people in Congress. People don't even know. So fast, yeah. Thank you for the, for the GG. I'm so fast. I'm, I'm fast on my feet. I read a lot. You know, I'm mentally sharp. I do not track macros at all. No, sir. 19 years old, I lift a lot, and I eat a lot of protein, and I sleep a lot. Fast? Yo, y'all got my back today. Y'all got my back today. I'm fast and clever. Right? Now, the next thing that I need to do, I'm fast, I'm clever, I'm I'm sharp, I'm good at reading. Now I need to actually enter, like, interact with a woman though like maybe that's just the one part of my life that's missing he's only slow with the what connect bro what 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 just happened bro bro they just said I had inactivity in my life. Like I was just not moving. Like, like I was just. They just made me drag a puzzle to make sure I was active. You're not good with girls either. Um, I, I actually, I don't identify as not being good with girls. I identify as being great with women. I'm a ladies man, actually. I'm a ladies man, you know? Exactly, bro. It's like it's like when you're so fast, it's just blurry. That's what TikTok was thinking. I said <laughs> Yo, if that ain't the realest thing I've seen all day, bro. Oh my gosh, you know, I'm so comfortable with my homies, bro. We just be in bed. I just Bro, it, like it, if I genuinely wanted to visit my homies, bro, it would be game over. But then I'll see like a like a fine girl in like a pump cover, bro, with her dark sport on, bro. I just my heart starts beating. I just don't know what to say, bro. The words just don't come out of my mouth, and I'm just my just got zero thoughts. Bro. That's that's my whole life right there, bro. That's my whole life, bro. Dude, I really have to go to the bathroom. 
Visiting the home is easy, yeah, bro. Yeah, I, I take creatine five grams a day from Legion, blue raspberry flavor. I've been taking creatine for a minute, maybe a year and a half, two years, I don't know. Long time. You popped in at an interesting time. Indeed, you did. Welcome to the Sauce Fam. If any of you 52 people are new here, I post a lot. I, I post a lot more on Instagram. Would I date a gym girl? It, uh, is the sky blue? Yes. Yes. You always gonna go, bro. I you have to go pee. I have to go to school. If people aren't talking, I'm not gonna be alive for too long. Oh. Do you have a girlfriend? Unfortunately, I'm single. I mean, there's there's pluses and minuses, you know. Like pluses, like you don't like have to listen to a lot of just nonsense about the world. Minuses, you don't have a girl to interact with. I, yeah, I'm in college still. Girls can't touch me, I'm too fast. Exactly, bro. By TikTok, bro, she'll come when she comes, facts. I would say I'm extremely picky. I, I wouldn't say I'm picky. I just have high standards. And I just, I actually don't know. But yeah, I'm not gonna. Dude, picking your wife is one of the most important decisions you can make in the world as a man. Picking your wife, bro. Like, out of all of the things that you, like, there's so many little decisions. That is a huge decision. <laughs> like, when people say the right one, like, she can either propel you so much, like she can, she can uplift you. She can like make your life so much better or she can just ruin it, bro. I never said I need to get married right now. I'm 19, bro. But yeah, I, I mean, like you see relationships. Yeah. Like part of you makes you kind of want one, but like. I enjoy my life, my life. Yeah, wife. I'm not. I don't date for fun. I'm not looking at girls like, yeah, no, this is a short term girl. No, no, bro. Like, I don't. I don't think having a high body count is really anything to be looked up upon. I don't think it's cool. My thoughts on hookup culture? Don't think it's cool. Hidden dip? Don't think that's cool. I think there's, when we go back to Christianity and how God like said sex after marriage, how, like he's doing that. He says that to protect us, bro. How many bad things happen, potential bad things can happen when you do stuff like that, you know, a lot of potential bad things can happen. Yeah, yeah, no, for sure. You have to actually want to spend time around the person that you're going to spend the rest of your life with. Well, yeah, what, what's the point of dating someone, though, if you're just preparing for a breakup? Like, if you, if you date someone, you break up with someone, yeah, that's life. But I'm not going to date someone for fun. If I want fun, I go to the gym. I pick up a hobby. I don't date people for fun. Like, playing with people's feelings is not fun. Yeah, and it's, it's a waste of time. Like, there is a balance, though. Like, some people say, oh, if, if there's so many apples, how do you know if you're going to pick the right one if, you, if you're only trying one? Like, that's a good question, bro. But it's like, let me get a, let's take an analogy. What if... I don't know. You're searching for the right apple and you're just wasting all your time. <laughs> I don't know. Like, yeah. Or seed. 
like gen like genuinely though if if i'm like like chasing after women and like yeah i have a girlfriend but it's like in the back of my head i just think that it's not going to work out and i don't think she's i'm going to be with her for the long term i mean like i wouldn't think that's a good check on my time long live by nba amboy there is definitely a right one if someone makes you genuinely genuinely happy that is the right one that is the right one you don't marry the wrong one long live by nba young boy You'll know the right girl when she comes into your life. You gotta, you got more than enough time. I mean, yeah. If you're in a arranged marriage. <laughs> I mean, crap, bro. If you, if you had an arranged marriage, at least you wouldn't have to like spend time on like, like who's the right one. We're gonna miss TikTok's community. Hey, th this is only the beginning. We, I, I post a lot more on my Instagram, bro. If TikTok goes, I'll still be here on my Instagram. Like, whatever happens, happens. Life still goes on at the end of the day. I'm not going to cry about it. If TikTok goes, boohoo. Dude, I really have to go. Taylor Swift? Oh, no. I don't listen to Taylor Swift. Actually. There's six months to sell. Oh. Six months, that's a, like that's like 180 days. Is there even a reason for it going? So what exactly did I need to go to the bathroom? Bro, I, I can I mute myself though? Literally look up look up on Apple Music. Look up Austin Whitworth music. <gasps> Oh my gosh. It was one of those like, you know, very long ones, but it will feel good now. That guy, that guy. Yeah, I, I wax my legs. Yeah, I do. Did I wash my hands? No, I did not. I didn't touch the Johnson though, but what else do I wax? My arms occasionally. Might be right after. You're definitely not a fast learner. Is it that loud? <laughs> All right. Don't wash your hands in your own home? Exactly. Exactly. What is this? I think it's time to get off. All right, y'all, you're not done, but if I'm done, then I'm freaking done. What? <laughs> Yo. All right, y'all. I hope y'all have a great day. Thank you for, for tuning in. Amazing physique. Thanks, bro. A mischievous? Does that mean, like, evil? What? But I hope y'all have a great day. If y'all want to support me and follow more of my content, go follow the Instagram. 
Same username as my TikTok. We're not going anywhere. Even if TikTok goes, I'll still always be on the gram. So follow that. Follow YouTube. Same username as my TikTok. Have a great day, y'all. And peace out, bro.